Hey guys, um, so with this video, I kind of wanted to um, show you guys something that may help all of you who own the LG Realm, because uh, I know this device doesn't have very much uh, storage space, and besides uh, rooting the phone and debloating it, there are, well, there is another method that I, I uh, did uh, yesterday, and so I wanted to talk to you guys about it and show you guys so um, to do this you will need to be rooted so you can check out my video on how to root the LG realm um, and you're gonna grab a few things and I will show you what you'll need but you're gonna need to partition your SD card uh, your, your external SD card and um, so you can either do that with a, a laptop if you don't have access to a laptop, you can partition the SD card on your smartphone. You just need to um, uh, search a SD partition app, and it's going to be this one right here, a parted, which is an SD card partitioner. So, um, well, I'll install it so I can show you guys what it looks like. It's uh, accept. And um, you're going to use this to partition your your uh, SD card, so you can create um, an EXT3 partition and a Linux swap if you choose to. So we'll just wait for it to install, and then um, okay. So here we are. You need to grant it super user permissions, and uh, once it does you'll see this screen right here and uh, it's just let it do its thing until it fully loads and uh, it, it comes with this really big ad that's just gonna pop up but you could just click the X to uh, remove the ad see there's like a little X up here just click that's moving away now uh, before you can partition your SD card, you need to make sure you go to settings and storage and then unmount the SD card. That way you can set up partitions. And when you do set up the partitions, the first one needs to be FAT32. So that's uh, your first partition. And you'll do that by clicking this plus sign, and you can create your partitions. So the first one will be FAT32. Your second one will be either EXT3 or EXT2. And then your third partition, if you choose, can be Linux Swap, which, you know, it, it does help uh, with, uh, you know, switching between applications and stuff. It does help keep things a little fast. So then once you're done setting up your partitions and how much you want, uh, each partition to be. You'll hit apply changes and it will partition your SD card as you guys can see right here. My SD card is already partitioned with about 5 gigs is a FAT32 and a little under 2 gigs is uh, my EXT3 and then I have 96 megabytes of Linux swap. So once you partition your SD card you're gonna want to download this application called Link to SD. So you guys can see I have storage pretty much open up for you guys. And with uh, with this application, you can actually um, move applications to your second partition, as you guys can see right here. That's my internal storage. Uh, try to get it to focus here. Hold on. <laughs> there it goes. So you guys can see like my internal SD card. With, you know, which is uh, my internal storage is at 54%. Uh, external SD is 99%. I don't have nothing on it yet. And then my second partition has 82% free. That one, that 1.83 gigs is uh, free out of uh, 2.22 gigs of uh, that storage space. That's my second uh, partition. So it really does help because before I did this, my internal, I had like maybe 
31% free. And as you guys can see, I got a little bit close to half of it free just by moving applications to the SD card, which is very simple because if you want to move something to the SD card, you know, simply, you know, click it. And then down here it says uh, create a link. Click create a link and you can choose uh, how, what parts of the application is moved over to the SD card. And there it is. So let's get it to focus again. Leaked, and it's on the SD card. And it's in the second partition, not in the main uh, FAT32 system of the SD card. So that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, that's just one way that, that can help free up some memory on the LG Realm. Sorry I sound so weird. I am still clogged up and stuffy. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So if you guys found this video to be helpful with your LG Realm, go ahead and give me that thumbs up. It really helps me out. And uh, go ahead and... Uh, Click that subscribe button. Join all the awesome fun. And I'll see you guys next time with another video.